for the last month. It seems every day is a tribute to Letterman, with increasingly famous guests. Well, I suppose they stopped being increasingly famous after Obama did it, appearing on The Late Show and saying their own gracious farewells to the host of so many American evenings at home. Last night was Tom Waits' turn. The veteran musician with the beautiful voice of a malfunctioning concrete mixer returned to performing after a two-year hiatus and gave a heartfelt tenth late-night performance with a fittingly titled new song, Take One Last Look. This could also, if Arrested Development ever returned to Netflix, perfectly double as Katie Sanchez's theme song. Relatedly, The Mindy Project was rescued by Hulu today. And in anticipation of another season you may or may not want, here are 20 things you probably don't know about the show. While the few celebrities who aren't at Cannes have been saying farewell to Letterman, those who are attending the festival have her greeting some of the best, or overhyped by virtue of star and almighty director power, films of the year. The Matthew McConaughey starring Gus Van Sant film Sea of Trees, which seems to follow two men who try to commit suicide in Japan's suicide forest, and then have epiphanies together, was the first film to get booed at the festival. Meanwhile, clips have emerged from Natalie Portman's directorial debut, A Tale of Love and Darkness, and the already acclaimed satire, The Lobster, starring Colin Farrell, John C. Riley. Rachel Wise, Ben Wishaw, Olivia Coleman, and Lee Sedu.